everyone, it's Aaron Plato Labs. Now, the, this is called, this project name is called Wireless Doorbell. It doesn't mean that nothing is connected by wires. It's like uh, it could send a signal to something using the transmitter and receiver. If you don't know what that is, it, the transmitter will send the signal and the receiver will receive the signal uh, and do whatever whatever the circuitry is going for. Yeah. Here are the co connections. There are two connections. Transmitter connections and receiver connections. Let's start with the receiver connections. It's a short one for both of them. So let's go. Battery, receiver, sound. Now the transmitter connections. Battery, transmitter, button. It's such an easy connection. But... You could make an entire wireless doorbell with just this easy connection sky. So, here is what it functions, how it functions. The transmitter will send a signal to the receiver. Then the, the signal from there will turn into the, I mean the signal will, will go, go to the receiver. Yeah, then... Uh, it will uh, uh, make, make a few electricity go through this wire to, and power on the sound so that it will give us doorbell. So, let's see how it works. Here is one important thing. These, this uh, outputs and inputs should be always opposite. Let's say we kept it on output 1. First you should say this input. We, we kept it in input 4, right? Input 1. Input 1. Uh, input uh, 4, right? If we, if we change it for input 1, this, uh, this should be an input 4. Get it? Input 4. Input 4, output 1. Output one. Output 4, input 1. And, and this, input 2, out, output 3. Input 3, output 2. That, that's it. Now, let us look at how it will function. And you have to on these two at the same time. Or else the circuitry won't work on okay now when we press the button sound is coming now uh, i will go far and you could see this see it's still coming if i go even more far still working farthest i could go 